Hey, what's up? I'm Sean Solo 8, and today I'll be opening Star Wars The Vintage Collection Luke Skywalker Yavin. This one right now is a Walmart exclusive, so that's the only way you can get it. Uh, I love the picture straight out of A New Hope with his medallion. Uh, he does come with his lightsaber and blaster up there on the front, and it looks like he can put his gun in his holster. So this figure looks absolutely epic. I love how they keep giving us the Kenner logo down there on the bottom and the classic Luke and Leia uh, up there on the top. You can see he is VC-151, uh, and he is available currently uh, at Walmart. So if you want one, head on over there. He's really cheap on Walmart.com, too. But there's the Disney Hasbro logo and the UPC if you need it. But thanks for checking out today's video. If you're new around here, consider subscribing and checking out my other Star Wars reviews. Without further ado, let's open this guy up and check him out. Bam! Okay, Luke Skywalker is free from his packaging and he looks like he's definitely stoked because he's super cooperating with me. He wants to stand on this thing first try, uh, my little rotating table. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of the new rotator. Uh, we'll, I don't know what we'll name it, but we'll figure something out. Uh, also, the lightsaber just clicks right into his belt, so that was an amazing touch. You can also see his holsters like strapped around his leg here. Uh, it doesn't look like it's glued on, but we will take a closer look at that once we get into his articulation. Uh, I'm going to also zoom up on his face here in a minute for you guys because the hair, the detail, Hasbro has completely knocked it out of the park with this one. Yeah, look at his hair. I mean, just that is insane. And look at his chin, his bags under his eyes. Uh, also, next time he swings around, check where his finger is. I just put his gun right in his hand, no struggles at all, but it goes right inside the little trigger hole, which is absolutely amazing. You can see all the wrinkles on his jacket. Uh, and yeah, Hasbro really knocked it out of the park on this one. Uh, great job, but now let's take a closer look and I'll point out anything else that I notice. All right, now I'm going to be going over uh, some close details and articulation that I can see in Luke here. But as I was saying earlier, his gun fits absolutely perfect uh, in his holster there. And the lightsaber just pops off in that little uh, peg hole that you see right here. And there's the peg on the lightsaber. But see how beautiful the lightsaber is? Uh, they did a really, really good job on that. And let me show you a close-up of his gun so you can see that. But uh, pretty basic, straightforward blaster but again the detail is really really good uh the metal uh let me pull this off his head uh, see how easy it comes off here so yeah that does come off and it's a nice soft rubber so uh if you wanted to get multiple of these i have the leah i don't have the han solo uh but yeah luke looks absolutely awesome man the head is incredible the paint and the hair is incredible uh but he does uh, look down about that far. Uh, he does look up pretty good too. Uh, his head does do a couple tilts. Uh, but yeah, look at that. That's absolutely amazing. Great job, Hasbro. Uh, his arms go all the way up. Look at that. That's pretty wild. So he can do whatever he wants there. Uh, no upper swivel. They do rotate around perfectly. So he's fine there. Uh, let me fix your arm there, buddy. Luke. Uh, his arm does bend up about that high. Uh, it does rotate also in his trigger hand. Uh, looks like it's just pegged in there. Really not much going on here. Uh, maybe he has a different version coming later where he has interchangeable hands. Uh, this arm goes up a little bit, a little bit higher than the other, but this hand actually does have a little bit of a, a tilt in there too, but the detail in his hands look really good too. But this is a great figure, guys. I wouldn't pass on this one or wait. Uh, the holster, yeah. It's actually separated. Uh, his jacket, obviously, uh, he's got that cool black vest underneath with his Han Solo belt. I love how they try to make him into like, you know, a new smuggler. His leg does bend up about that high. Uh, his feet do bend and tilt just barely, but they're so tight. Uh, and they're, I don't see any swivel in his boot. His boot is completely stiff. Yeah, there's no articulation in his boot at all uh, that I see. And I'm sure I'm not missing nothing. So yeah, no articulation uh, in his boots, but he stood just fine for me. Uh, maybe that makes it even better that way. But what do you guys think? Do you have a Yavin Luke? Let me know in the comments below. And I will see you guys in the next video.